this is probably the easiest tie knot you will ever learn. It's the four in hand. It's probably the one that most people learnt at school, but maybe you've forgotten. Maybe you've never tied a tie before. Anyway, this is the place to learn how to do it. Two things I need in return. Give the video a like if you've done it. Maybe drop in the comments where you're watching it from because these videos go all over the world and it's quite nice to see where they're going. Just put your phone next to the mirror and copy it exactly like for like. I'm going to be shooting this video in that mirror, so that means you can literally just copy it and it will be so easy, I promise you. Right, that's the talking done. Let's get on with it. First things first, you want to do up the top button of your shirt and you want to make sure that the seams of the tie are against your chest. This thin end of the tie is going to need to be shorter than the thick end of the tie because the thick end always does the wrapping around. So try to Try to add, have maybe a foot, foot and a half extra of blade when you're doing this, but it will depend on your neck size and your body length. So you will have to play around with this a few times. Now, this is super quick, super easy. Cross the thick end of the tie over the thin end, okay? Index finger and thumb can hold it together. You then wanna just bring this thick end round the back, across the front, and then from behind you want to go through this loop. So go through the loop and then tuck it through that bit you made at the front. Now as you pull the thick end of the tie, hold the thin end and that will tighten the knot. Now. I always squeeze the bottom of the knot and hold the thin end as I bring the knot up to my neck. I'll give the blade a tug, pull it again, give the blade a tug, pull it again. That will allow you to create a really nice looking knot. Now the four in hand knot is not a symmetrical knot. It doesn't matter that this side looks different to this side. It's actually part of its charm. So. That is effectively now tied. You can tuck the thin end into the back of the tie, put it through the keeper loop at the back, which is this little loop that you'll often have in the back of your tie, or if not, you can probably tuck it through the label. And then you just put your collar down. And there you have a beautiful tie knot. Okay, so there you go. That is the four in hand tie knot. I told you it was easy and that means we can complete our little deal. You can click the like button and you can also put in the comments whereabouts in the world you are watching this from. If it's your first day of school, no smoking behind the bike sheds, okay? Okay, now that is it. Enjoy whatever it is you're going to. If you wanna learn some different tie knots, you can check out some of our other videos. Check out our business at reefknots.com and you can always click the subscribe button, then you'll always be in touch. Anyway, might see you around, might not. Oh, 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 oh,